So the first step of creating the corset was um, prepping this extra material that I had in order to use it to make the mock-up. So I had previously used this for another project and there was a lot of threads in it, so I had to go through and pick all those out. And then it was time to get out the pattern pieces and to start tracing them with chalk on the fabric. Before we get into it though, first a little break to play with Freya and her little Charmander toy that Hoki gave her when we got married and he moved in. She freaking loves this thing guys, it's adorable. Okay, so back to tracing. Um, I, when I trace fabric, I always use these bells to weight down the pattern piece just so things don't shift around. So, um, spending the next little while doing this process, which, which takes some time, but it's worth it because then your pieces are all cut out properly and exactly, which is important when you're doing a corset. are cut out. It's time to kind of clear my space, get the ruler, and start marking out where the seam allowance goes so that I can know where to actually cut the fabric. There were a few goof ups in the spot where as I was tracing out the pattern pieces, I forgot to leave room for the seam allowance on all sides. Um, so I did have to re-sketch some of the pieces and then redo the seam allowance as well. during the Twitch stream, we got to talking about when I went up to Acadia for the Dream Gathering book signing with Kristen Britton and Christina Bischoff as part of the whole Green Rider book soundtrack thing and 
So we got distracted and started watching the video that I made. It was kind of fun to relive all these memories. So with all the pieces cut out for one side, it was then time to uh, start again doing the pieces for the other side of the corset. So here you can see me tracing them again, marking out the seam allowance, and eventually cutting those pieces out too. So that we have all the pieces and we can do all the sewing at once. Here you can see me redrawing that one piece again because, again, I forgot to allow for the seam allowance. Also, I seem to uh, keep forgetting that I'm getting in the way of the camera, so, oops. But that is a wrap for this Twitch stream, so in the next video, I will, I think, I get all the rest of the pieces cut out and we start pinning it all together. So, tune in to the next stream video.